Hello, I've got an unboxing to share tonight. I'm still full of this cold and having trouble actually smelling scents. So at first I was going to demo some um, some sort of lovely bath bomb and then I thought I'll probably have a salt, Epsom salt bath or something like that this evening because I can't smell much again. So I thought um, I'll show you this little box that I've been looking forward to opening. I've had it a few days now. And this is from the company House of Ashes and um, it's Lou and Lanka and they make some lovely products and I've already opened it with the scissors. I've got my peppermint tea on the go here, the Julia Smith uh, mug as usual on the go and um, let's dive in and have a look see what's in here. I ordered um, three products look at that they're so so pretty this is the poisonous apple which i haven't smelt yet and obviously um i can't describe to you at the moment but doesn't it look beautiful the bath art from the bath bombs is stunning really really pretty and um yeah this is the bombshell poison apple and uh just looking at the ingredients i always check extra just in case because I don't want any almond oil in anything so that's wonderful and so <laughs> it's like a mixture of pumpkin apple really like the look of that still I can't quite smell it yet soup and um, I'm hoping it does smell of apple to be honest <laughs> fingers crossed because I know they sent them with um, different kinds of scents sometimes a popular perfume as well and things like that and um, this one, oh wow, look at this, it's getting a bit loud then, my son's not going to fall asleep, but look at that, this one is called Bombshell Bones, and this one I think someone said reminded them of sweets, I think it was sweets, I'm trying to remember, but something attracted me to it, look at the details, even those teeth. And they're really big. I don't know if the camera's showing it, but they are really, really big. And, oh, I don't think they mentioned it. As you can see, it's packaged in fresh hay with rose petals. And this is lovely because my rabbit, I'm hoping, will start eating more hay. She's actually over six years old. She's never ate much hay. And um, I keep trying to entice her, and I'm wondering, hoping that the rose petals will. But I think it's such a good way to package products. Um, yes, it can get everywhere, but it's not that bad, really. And um, it's just such a good envir environmentally friendly way to do it, isn't it? So, yeah, it's quite a good idea. And um, anyway, back to the products. Oh, that's the little card from Lou and Lenka. And they say the skin witches. They're on Instagram if you want to have a look. See the rose petals here. Wow, this is Spellbound, which is one I actually do know about. And um, it's another sort of fruity sweet scent to my nose. I really enjoyed it. The bath art again was absolutely amazing. And um, if you are interested in trying some of the products, one of my favourites was the rhubarb and custard um, shower wash, I think it was called shower cream that, that was lovely but um if you are interested i think it's some um, i'm trying to remember their times they put theirs up whether it's the friday or the sunday but they are on instagram if you want to check them and see if you want to try any of them any of their products but um as you can see they they really do look amazing and um let's actually get them out and then have a look at these glittery, glittery things. There we go. And, uh, they look really nice. Sorry about the lighting because it's evening. It produces a strange light, I suppose. But yeah, I thought I'll come and show you these. I can't wait to smell these two myself. And I might actually try and make them part of a demo so you can see what they're like. If you're interested as well, look at that, all the rose petals. 
as I say, I really hope they interest Luna Rabbit. That would be really, really nice. But I'm going to get back to my peppermint tea and have a nice salty bath to help her feel a bit better. But um, anyway, it's still better than it was a few days ago. I hope you're having a brilliant start to the weekend, everyone. Take care. I'll be back soon. Bye.